Hello everyone, welcome to HDC 2020. In this issue, you will learn about the overview of Huawei Wallet Kit, as well as how to integrate the kit. Before let's start, I will introduce myself briefly. I'm Chen Yilian, the Operation Manager of Huawei Wallet at Wallet Kit. Let's look at today's sharing. There are three parts. First is the Wallet Kit introduction. Then, let's discuss how to boost the partner's business with one kit. Finally, let's see the advantages brought by integration with one kit. Okay, let's come to the first part. What's one kit? Huawei one kit is an open capability that aims to build an all-in-one wallet lifestyle with convenient access to multiple passes. It allows users to easily add all types of electronic passes and vouchers such as loyalty cards, gift cards, boarding passes, event tickets, and coupons on their smartphones for convenient anytime use. In addition, it also facilitates interactions between your apps and the users via location-based notifications, real-time status updates. It's easy to integrate Wallet Kit with your app for users to add electronic passes to Huawei Wallet in multiple methods, such as by email, SMS message, app, web page, and HTML5. Based on Huawei's unique full-stack, cheap device cloud technology, you will have a wealth of marketing resources and capabilities at your fingertips, such as message push, near-field communication, NFC, and security chips, making Wanted perfect for numerous scenarios. For example, the credit cards, access cards, payment cards, and car keys. Now, there are many partners who have integrated with Huawei Wallet Kit, many in three domains. The first is traveling. There are three benefits for the partners. Firstly, simplifying the business ticketing. There is no need for physical tickets, texts, or emails with downloadable PDFs. Everything users need will be stored and managed through Huawei Wallet. Secondly, optimizing the smart pass experience. The kit facilitates interactions between apps and users through status updates and reminders. Thirdly, customizing the pass detail page on Huawei Wallet. There is a gateway through which your app can receive heavy data traffic. And to users, it's an easy access to travel data. Users can store and refer to all important travel information on a streamlined digital platform, including tickets, boarding passes, and bookings on their mobile phones for convenient anytime use. The second domain is commerce. After integration with Wallet Kit, it enables users to store their loyalty cards, coupons, or gift cards to Huawei Wallet for immediate access to rewards and purchase histories, as well as send push notifications and reminders to maximize engagement. In addition, saving event tickets for paperless assets have dramatically improved the convenience and the efficiency for users. And for the third domain, domain the E1 solution, there are two advantages for the B2B partners. For one thing, it's easy to integrate, minimizing development work and accelerating the service rollout timeline. For another, OneKit enhances their competitiveness by supporting all types of passes, giving users endless possibilities for campaigns. Next, let's see how to improve partners' business in these three domains one by one. The first is traveling. As we know, new business opportunities are arising from China's market with the enthusiasm for global traveling. Huawei Wallet will help our partners to expand the business in China with a base of more than 500 million users. For example, each year, there are about 3 million tourists from China to Indonesia, more than half of whom are using Huawei phones. Huawei Wallet will promote the partner apps with Wallet Kit integrated to the tourists. In this case, these tourists may add loyalty cards and coupons they need before departure. 
and they will enjoy a happy shopping in their destination, which may bring another 1.5 million users for partners. And for the commerce, why we want it is becoming a new traffic entry to boost the partners' O2O business. Let's talk from it from two parts. First is on my part. Why we want it provides a special featured membership page to attract traffic for partners and promote the sales of their coupons. You also can customize the past detail page to direct users to pages on your apps with wallet keep. The second part is offline. Through the location-based notifications, users may choose to add loyalty cards or coupons obtained by email or SMS message or from the membership page to Huawei Wallet on their smartphones. When the users are around the mall, they will be notified by Huawei Wallet of consumption using the loyalty cards or coupons. In conclusion, Huawei Wallet has dramatically optimized users' overall O2O shopping experience. Next, then we'll see how to enhance the e-wallet solution competitiveness with the wallet kit. Let's take smart football ticket as an example. After buying a ticket of a football match through your app, a user chooses to add the ticket to Huawei Wallet, where the user can view the ticket. When the match is approaching, the user will receive a reminder on the smartphone. When arriving at the match, the user only needs to swipe your phone without unlocking the full screen to enter the venue. The past detail page on Huawei Wallet may come become a gateway through which your app receives highway traffic because users can be directed to pages on your app such as the loyalty card page, storage page, or pages for related services. Wow, that's really an amazing journey of football watching. In the future, we will continue to develop a greater range of capabilities to assist you in app promotion. Okay, next, let's see the advantages brought by integration with Wallet Keep. Firstly, we are willing to share our ecosystem in China with our partners. There are more than 500 million users worldwide. In China, transit cards are applied to more than 300 cities, and we have cooperated with IHG hotel membership cards, smart case key, keys of Samsonite, Samsonite, and smart car keys of BYD. There are more than 100,000 community access cards developed. All the resources are open to our partners. Secondly, security. We always take the first priority to security. Thanks to secure chips, important data will be stored in the TEE level environment. Besides, wanted kit complies with GDPR, GAPP, and local laws and regulations. Most importantly, the kit does not affect op operations on apps. The third is better user experience. The kit implements policy swiping without unlocking the screen, as well as intelligently choosing proper cards for your users. Besides, the kit does well in precise marketing with promotion message push. Finally, let's see the integration process in detail. This is a quite simple process where only one SDK and seven steps are required. The integration workload is small and the quickest one only takes four hours to complete the integration. Besides, one kit has drawn acclaim around the world since being released earlier in 2020. You are able to quickly obtain related information from the official website. In addition, there are dedicated sections in GitHub and the Stack Overflow for Wallet Kit, where you are free to post any related questions. Okay, that's the end of today's sharing. Thank you for listening and welcome to join us and join global developers to bring better and smart life to your users with Huawei Wallet Kit. Hello everyone, my name is Yusuf Freitas and I am the CEO of Development VR.
Many thanks to Huawei for the invitation to participate in this fantastic event and to be able to tell everyone, even if it's virtually, the benefits of WalletKit focused on our application pass to pay We hope that everyone is well and in good health. This is the first time that our company Development ER participates in an HDC, something we are very proud of and that is the result of our close collaboration with the company, both now with WalletKit and in the past, with their other services and APIs. It may sound like a jet de cliché, but at Development ER we try to adapt to the main needs of our users, improving their experience and solving the small problems they encounter on a daily basis. In fact, a very important part of our developments focuses on studying the latest software novelties looking for how they could be useful for the vast majority of people. This is where Huawei comes in with WalletKit, a key piece in our latest application. From the very beginning when Huawei launched this API, we wanted to work on adding it to pass to pay In the world, there are many standards for passes. Many companies are trying to create the standard that exists and that everyone uses, but the truth is that it is very complicated. With so many competitors in the market, it is impossible to create something for everyone. Apple, for example, has tried, with no success outside its platform. Here, you can say that pass to pay imports different types of passes, such as movie tickets, concerts, boarding passes, or even promotional cards either from PK Pass files, PDF documents, airplane tickets in BCBP format, or even by scanning images as you can see on the screen. All these directly to the payment platform preferred by its user. Until now, we've only worked with Google Pay, but when we heard that Huawei was working on a unified platform for payments and pass storage, we wanted to take our application to the next level saving all passes to a safe place inside all compatible Huawei phones in a very simple way. As we said, the way the app works is very simple. Whatever the input method, in this case, a PK pass file that comes to us via an email, all you have to do is fill in the data that is requested for each type of pass. In this case, coming from a PK pass, we can already obtain many of the data, so the user will not have to fill them in, unless he wants to change anything. When you are satisfied, the only thing left to do is click on the button at the end of the screen to generate the pass and add it to your wallet. The truth is that the wallet kit functions are perfectly adapted to this need, allowing us to easily add all kinds of passes through our app, benefiting the large community of users that Huawei already has. Thanks to a close relationship with Huawei, we have been able to easily add the new features of wallet kit to our app always taking into account the needs of our users. Having a real communication channel with the company allows us to be more productive while continuing to innovate and keep growing with new apps. With pass to pay available in the app gallery, we are getting even closer to a large number of users who have access to Huawei Wallet, and we hope that in the future more Huawei services can reach this and many others of our apps. Join us to build an intelligent lifestyle with Huawei Wallet Kit. Thanks for your invitation, Ivy. I'm David from PassCreator, and next to me is sitting Johannes from Streamboxy. PassCreator has just released support for Huawei Wallet. PassCreator is a SaaS solution that allows customers to create, manage, and analyze wallet campaigns, which can be anything from event tickets, vouchers, store cards, or even generic cases. PassCreator has customers from more than 40 countries and includes everything you need to set up your wallet campaign, including a what you see is what you get editor for wallet passes. PassCreator has issued more than 50 million passes since its launch back in 2012. Integrating Huawei Wallet into PassCreator allows us to expand our global reach and serve Huawei users even better. When a customer sets up a campaign in PassCreator, he logs into the online application and designs the wallet pass. For each pass that is generated, a unique URL is created and sent to the end user. No matter how, which way you choose to do that, being it an ad, an e-commerce store, a text message or an email, the end user clicks on that link, the download page for the wallet pass is opened and the user can tap the add to wallet button to save the wallet pass on his phone. Johannes, can you tell us something about Streamboxy? Sure. Streamboxy is a SaaS solution for online trainings, 
hybrid events and structured meetings. We got you covered from the beginning where you plan your event, manage your participants during the event with live video chat, live stream, tons of interaction with your audience, even if they are on site or if they are online. After the event we have a recording for you and your participants and we have evaluation and other cool stuff that helps you uh, managing your participant even when the event is over. We offer our customers the best participant experience, whether they're online or on-site. This brought us together with Pass Creator and the wallet solution brought us uh, a way to have one audience made out of on-site users and online users. This is done using a on-site check-in Using the wallet pass on the participant's phone combined with the Pass Creator companion app. When a wallet pass is created in Pass Creator, the system automatically generates a unique download URL. That URL is sent to the user. If the user decides to save the wallet pass, he clicks on Add to Huawei Wallet. And in that case, Pass Creator sends an API call to Huawei Wallet's API. In that process, the personal data of the user, if there is any on the pass, is transferred and the pass is generated. After the pass has been generated, Pass Creator automatically redirects the user to a download URL that adds the wallet pass to the user's wallet. Johannes, you're using the Pass Creator API in Streamboxy to create the on-site check-in for users. Tell us how that works. Right. When a user signs up for our event, we use the Pass Creator API to create wallet pass, and we send this wallet passes right with the confirmation mail to our participant. The participant opens the mail, clicks on the link to the pass, and adds the pass to his wallet. From there, he's ready for the event and is presenting the wallet pass to your companion app. Exactly. That means as soon as the user is arriving on site, he flips out his phone, shows the wallet pass that is scanned using the Pass Creator companion app, and Pass Creator then sends the user's ID back to the Streamboxy API. Therefore, Streamboxy knows what user has arrived on site and can display the status in the user interface of Streamboxy. Thanks for watching. If you need more information, check out passcreator.com or streamboxy.com. My name is Martin from BlueSource. Thanks for the invitation, Huawei. We are here at the headquarters of Mobile Pocket in Central Europe in Austria. BlueSource is a developer-centric company. We focus on pioneering the consumer journey at the point of sale. What do we do at BlueSource? We mainly digitalized mobile and loyalty and reward system. We do this over a long period of time. Our customer base are financial institutions, fintechs, brands and merchants. So basically everybody who is part of the consumer journey when you think about payment. The core and the heart of our company is the smartphone. This is where we think around 
This is where we build solutions. Mobile Pocket is an ecosystem. It consists of an application. So the app with the end consumer is the core element of our whole solution suite. Let me introduce to you how Mobile Pocket works. From a consumer perspective, you have the app on your phone. With the app, you can either digitalize your existing loyalty cards that you own already. Also, we have club cards, membership cards from NGOs, from sports clubs, you name it. You bring them all together into your phone by scanning them. But why do you do that? The app itself is a clear single point of entry when you enter a store, when you go to the stadium, when you enter the gym, you can show your card or your club membership directly on your phone in one single place. But why do you need that? Because in general, what you want to have from your favorite brands are the offers, the coupons, the discounts, or the news from your favorite sports club. So this is what you are looking for. And we at Mobile Pocket deliver you that all together in one single place. And now with Huawei Wallet, it even gets better because you have natively in Huawei Wallet at the fingertip your loyalty club cards at a glance. Inside of our Mobile Pocket world, we have a wide range of brands and merchants who we work with. Those companies seek to digitalize their relationships with end consumers. And we at Mobile Pocket help them to bring their loyalty and reward solutions into the 21st century onto the smartphones. By doing that, we have quite some different kinds of angles to the game. We have banks using our suite to enrich a mobile payment journey. We have brands who are seeking for solutions like location-based services, couponing, mobile checkout processes, and payment. And we have merchants who truly want to digitalize their relationship with end consumers. All the three elements together, you find in the Mobile Pocket Hub ecosystem. With Huawei Wallet, it's a clear goal to extend our relationship with the end consumers and deliver a better consumer journey in the end. So the cooperation with Huawei and the Huawei Wallet Kit was really an interesting and smooth journey. So first of all, we had to evaluate what is the benefit when we work together with the wallet kit that we can deliver to our end consumers at Mobile Pocket. So the evaluation of the benefits was for us very, very simple to deduct because having a native user journey on a smartphone with an embedded application normally delivers a better solution. So the first step was easy for us. Thanks to the well-documented websites and samples and code snippets, we were able to also see that the integration of Huawei Wallet Kit into Mobile Pocket is feasible in a limited period of time. Very important for us as Mobile Pocket as developers was that we can manage the risk. So we need to know that software that we integrate as a SDK, as a development kit into our suite and deliver that then to end consumers needs to be at our quality standards. Huawei did a great job at documenting and giving us that kind of information. Furthermore, our developers reached out from time to time to Huawei or to the support teams and were really impressed by the speed of the answers and the quality of information. To be honest, we didn't expect that kind of a fast process that supported us to walk smoothly through our development. The DNA of Huawei seems to be very strong, focused on innovation and growth. And I think there is a strong match between the two companies. Therefore, it was for us a quite simple process to integrate Huawei Wallet Kit 
into Mobile Pocket. We from Mobile Pocket benefit with the global reach of Huawei. So for us and for our consumer base, it is very interesting to actually reach new territories. Mutual growth is something that we have in common with our partners.